Hey YouTube, welcome back. We are headed off to the farm here. We are sufficiently chunky. Because I made a trip over to the um, bunker. We grabbed everything from the bunker and brought it back. We're going to go ahead and load up on food. And I just put food in my inventory, didn't I? I did. I'll go ahead and drop that. And we're going to head out. See if we can give this to this guy. Instead of taking the bait, bro. Just saying. Should have taken the bait. Now I really should I really should harvest him and cook the meat, but we've got a mission. We've got a wolf coat to craft. So there's him right there, and then there's also another wolf right there. But we're uh, 46 kilos out of 35, and I, I cannot run. I'm at a s slow, slow pace here. But both of the, all of the wolf hides should be ready to go now. I've got um, an improvised, two improvised knives. I've got two hatchets plus um, we should have everything we need to craft this. I've got 10 pieces of coal on me. I've got five fire logs. We're good to go for firewood, for fire making materials for the duration of crafting. Should have plenty. It's just a matter of getting over here safely. So let's see if we can't do that. I made a mistake coming up here, actually. Now I can get down safely here, okay. Just trying not to go down the main road, because last time I came through there, I was followed by a wolf. And I apologize, I'm trying to find the best place for my mic. I have yet to do that. Oh, hey, I need these. I don't, because I'm super heavy. But I do because you pick up everything in this game that you need when you see it for fear it won't be there or that you won't have it next time you need it. For those of you that don't know, I'm purposely dropping the cattail heads because I do not need them for fires. That's why you see them all over the place, like little hot dogs on ice. <laughs> it's just not a thing that I require. Right. Obviously being this over encumbered, the uh, Tired meter is going up, or rather, it's going down faster. Building up quicker, because we're more tired faster.
Well, that's not what you want to see. Shit. Right. Just go the other way. I ain't got time for you, brother. I'm hoping they just both go away and keep running. As far as the shell casings go, they will stay in my inventory for the duration. Uh, we've got to make it into the house to drop off the stuff in my inventory. And then we'll come back out and start a fire and get crafting. Let's just put that away so I'm not tempted to use it again because I'm slowly but surely running out of ammo. Get the hell out of here, bro. Not playing with you. Um, okay. Interesting. It's not what I meant to do, I meant to pick it up. Let's just go ahead and use this to light our fire. To hell with it. Um, and pick that up. There's uh, the flare. Look, we start fire. Come on. I've never been a huge fan of the marine flares. They're supposedly good for the timber wolves. I just. They're loud, annoying, and obviously it did nothing to that wolf. Okay, so we're going to use all these fire logs here. I say all. We're going to start with two of them. Also gonna put a lot of that in there. Okay, that is max capacity now. Um all right. and that took care of the weight. Super, okay. Oh, that's why I had that stupid rabbit on me. Ah damn, that's why. You dummy. Okay. So, oh, let's go grab the crafting materials. Okay, we don't want to be too long. We've got the fire going now. Okay, um, let's ditch for now. Put all that in there, all that. You, you. Um, I guess that's it for now. Okay, so that's cured. That's cured. That's cured. And we've got all these guts. And I think that's all we need for now. Get outside here. Perfect, okay. Let's get going. And I actually I'm gonna move over here. So I'm near the fire. So we want to make, oh yeah, one more. Right there. Okay, so four wolf pelts, four cured guts, and we're going to use 
50 arrows if we used a hunting knife. Be less if we used a hatchet, really. Oh no, less if we used a improvised knife, really. Okay. So let's go three hours with the improvised knife. I don't quite understand that, but all right. Okay, so let's go. A couple of pieces of coal here. wonder if we actually had one of these on us, would it help? I don't think it will, but... No, it didn't give us the option, okay. It's just going to be a long-ass time. I may just come back after I get a lot of this done instead of keeping you here doing all this boring stuff because anyway you see what we're doing I will bring you back after I get it completed and uh, then we're gonna get our stuff together pack up and we're gonna head off to mountain town this episode I will be back in a bit folks okay so we've got our sleep sleep schedule all jacked up again, but and we're we're exhausted. But here's the good news: we have got. Let's go find a drawer. We need to put that in there. What else? That's it. Oh, usually those disappear when you put stuff in a drawer. This one disappeared. Um. So, we officially have... Uh, our wolf skin coat made. And that should be our outer layer. Let's take all the rest of this stuff. We're going to take a minute and I should have probably brought more stuff with me, but that's all right. If we need to go outside and get it, we will. If I'm not too tired to sew, we may be able to take the rest of today and get sewing done here. So tired. Depends on if I start losing condition. Which it looks like I might. I needed to just take a quick nap. Sleep like two hours. It's not a bad thing to get our our sleep schedule all messed up because we can spend a good chunk of the day just repairing clothing, to be fair. Okay. Just need to close my eyes. Uh, let's repair these. It's going to be night time before we even get all this stuff done. So let's do this. If we have fire stuff, which we probably... Oh, uh, we don't. God dang, I've used everything. Uh, well, crap.
See if I can repair these before it hits complete, complete nighttime. Okay, got those done. The deerskin pants will be fine at 90 something percent. That's gonna break here in just a second. I'm feeling so drained. I know, buddy. One more. Yeah, okay, so one more piece of clothing. It's fine. Okay, so what else I was gonna show you? We've got our wolf skin coat done, we've got our deer skin pants made. And we've also got um, a whole bunch of arrow shafts crafted. And we've got two bows made as well. So we did all that. It took us about three days, granted. But it was important to get all that stuff made before we left. Now, tomorrow, we just have to sort out what we do and don't want to keep because we're not going to be able to climb with anything more than 35 kilos. So, night time again, let's go ahead and sleep. Get back on track here. We're gonna head down to the Overlook. While well, Grey Mothers drop crap off and then the Overlook. And, uh, go ahead and sleep two more hours here. And get the heck. I keep saying Mountain Town. We're heading to Mystery Lake is where we're heading, not Mountain Town. I'm gonna need to eat soon. You'll be fine, buddy. You'll be fine. And we uh, mashed all that deer meat that we had. It is all gone. <laughs> all of it. I'm going to go ahead and put all this into something. I don't want it just laying around. I don't think it'll despawn, but I don't remember to be, to be fair. If it's laying around, if it'll be a problem, so better safe than sorry, you know. Four minutes to repair. I could eat anything right now. Jeez. Oh, of course it's nasty now. Shit. That's what usually happens. Things disappear like that. Okay, let's go ahead and take all this back with us to Grey Mothers. Off what we don't need. Sort out the rest and get out of here. Well, the nature is not happy with us right now. Deleting her wolf brethren. That's all right. I'm not happy with uh, them eating us. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Here, 
hear you, Mackenzie. I hear you. I would love to play with the contextual UI or even with it off, but I just get so used to seeing everything. Because the UI for this game is very minimal as it is. Which I appreciate very much. So I don't think it's that bad to begin with. into a house, calm down. Fair, it's not a bad time to head down to the gas station. Since the wolves don't like the storms. I I have never seen many of the wolves out in the storms. Okay, we need to to be able to read all those books, but there's just no way. We're gonna leave them here. Sunday right there. And we do not need that much water. Uh, but we're going to drink first. And I'm pretty sure I saw that we were Eat a bunch of uh, venison outside. It's gonna dry us out. I'm gonna go ahead and mash this now for the trip. By the time we get back this way, it's gonna be rotten anyway. So.
I'm going to regret not bringing any food, but... As soon as I bring any food, I'm going to regret having brought it, so... Let's just go. wanted to bring the hacksaw and a tool kit, but I think we're probably going to find one. That should be rotten, yep. I didn't, did I? No, no I did not, okay. Any food here? Um, I didn't leave any ammo in there, did I? I think it's empty. No, it's empty. Okay. Uh, Stopping? No, it's not. Let's go ahead and sleep until we're rested because we've got a climb ahead of us. Plus, we're cold anyway. We actually have one, two, two climbs ahead of us if I remember right. Uh, I think we, I think we do. Oh gosh, it's been a while. I can't remember to be fair. Still storming? I think I hear it blowing. Yeah, let's give it another hour. Oh my gosh. I think I've left this filter on the whole time. Uh, oh my goodness, I have. If it has been too... too dark, or too bright, in the bright times, I apologize. <laughs> now it's coming up on nighttime. Ugh. All right, let me get us back to daytime, and I'll bring you back. We're gonna make this trip at daytime. We're not making it at nighttime. Yeah, let me get back to daytime, and I'll bring you back. Okay, there we go. Daytime. The weather sucks even worse now, but whatever. We're not gonna wait anymore. We're going. Daytime, we're going to take advantage of the fact that it's daytime. What's up, buddy? Searched all that? Yep, searched all that. This is what I was talking about. Feels like one degree Celsius, but you have a bed warmth bonus of five degrees. So at least your, your temperature is still going up when you're in a bed. Or in a bed roll. Even though the windows are all broke open, I, I don't understand it either. Alright. 
temperature shit, but we're gonna do it. Let's go. Luckily, the rope was on here. Let's get it. These always make me so damn nervous. Every time they make me nervous. Okay, now this one, it's been a hot minute, I think. I think you come down and around and there's like either a cave another climbing area or a cave and another climbing area one or the other longer we're out here, the worse the temperature gets. Is it over here? I don't think it's that way because that's taking us directly uphill. Oh, here we go. Thank you for clearing up, Jesus Christ. Okay, so I went right past here. Hello, rabbit. Now suddenly you can see the rabbits and everything. <laughs> and the wolves. Deer? Is that a deer? No, nope, that's a damn wolf. Of course it is. So is there a cave over here then? there was, but I guess not. I had a damn rock. my climbing spot right over there. Might be able to get away with this. Oh, here's the cave right here. Yep, right here. condition. Um, you know, actually, uh, we'll go ahead and start that with some cedar. Yeah, let's go ahead and warm up real quick. We'll heat up a coffee. Get us a little warmth bonus before we head up.
right, T, come on, give me the coffee. else amazing in here right no so that'll give us a little bit of benefit for climbing the rope as well let's go ahead and see if we can pump up this rope a little faster for on the other side. Here we go. I can tell you, you don't want to do these ropes with less than ha half, half or less than half of your stamina. I can promise you that's a bad idea. Verified. <laughs> All right. This scary bit. Don't look down. Just walk across. Slow and steady wins the race. Be a turtle. Be a turtle. I hear you wolves, I hear you. So these are deafening. I will try to tone these down in editing if I can. bad now. The sound from those used to be a lot worse. I do believe you get up here to this cave Probably call that a video there, and uh, next episode, we'll be walking into Mystery Lake. When we walk into Mystery Lake, we're going to want to, uh, not we're going to want to, we're going to have to go quite a little ways before we get to a safe spot. And I'm not going to just want to get there and call it good there. We'll be staying in the cave our safe, safe spot. So we'll be logging out in the cave. Okay, this bit here is a little loud. <laughs> see if we can see it. down there. Alright. This should say two mystery lake if I remember correctly. Leave Milton region, yep. And 
list. Oh, this may take us. I don't know. This may bring us right out at the Trapper's Cabin. Gosh, has it been that long? I don't remember. Hmm. Uh, oops. I'm hoping at the Trapper's Cabin we have a um, rifle with a few rounds in it and pray that we get lucky and have a spawn of a wolf right at the Trapper's Cabin. Best case scenario is that's going to happen for us. So will it will it to happen that's what we want I do believe that's where this comes out Have a good time. Not a take your book, though. That. I'll be hungry. I'm actually going to smash that. That deer has definitely worn off by now. Grabbing all this coal because the coal tends to uh, respawn in the caves. Just back here. Saw some wood. Let's go grab this. cabin so there's usually a deer in that little oh whatever it is barn broken down barn and once in a while you get lucky and there's a moose spawn that spawns right in there a path back and forth fingers crossed we get lucky enough to get that this game doesn't always happen. But maybe. I don't see any rabbits, but usually there's rabbits back here. Hopefully there's this birch. I don't see the birch up there this time either. Well, damn it. Okay. I don't see any ravens or crows. I don't see any crows up there. Hmm. All right, folks. Is there a gun? Oh, man, I don't see a gun. Ammo. Damn it. All right. 
Well, I am not going to exploit too much without you. So, we're going to call that good there. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.